Smart Analyzer is an idea component that performs predefined routines for specific audit or assurance procedures. Smart Analyzer enables you to run routines without having to define your own data analysis tests from scratch. IDEA comes with a few sample Smart Analyzer modules already installed, like the Sample General Ledger and the Sample Payments. Additional modules can be downloaded from Passport or the Marketplace. Let's walk through how to use the Sample General Ledger Smart Analyzer module. Before we get started, we need to import the General Ledger file, which is located in the Samples project. To switch to the Samples project, on the Home tab, click Open. Select the Samples project and click OK. Now that the Samples project is open, we need to import the General Ledger file. On the Home tab, click Import. Select Microsoft Excel and next to the file name, click the Browse button. Select General Ledger and click Open. Then click Next. Accept the default settings and click OK to import the General Ledger. Now let's test the data in this General Ledger file using Smart Analyzer Sample General Ledger. On the Smart Analyzer tab, in the Apps group, click Start. In the App Workflow dialog, click Sample General Ledger. The Sample General Ledger App Workflow screen appears. This workflow contains three steps to guide us through the Sample General Ledger app. Let's click on the first step, Create Data Request. Select the Sample General Ledger box and click OK. A document is prepared to assist you in requesting the data. The document contains all of the fields that are used in this Smart Analyzer module, so you can make sure that you are requesting the right source data. The document can be saved or printed from the toolbar. Since we already have our General Ledger database, we will close the data request document and move on to the next step in the app workflow. The next step in the app workflow is run audit tests. Before we can run the audit tests, we need to tag the file so that IDEA knows which fields to use for analysis. Click the Define button. In the Define Tags dialog box, we will select Amount for the first field. Select Description for the second field and JE No or Journal Entry Number for the fourth field. The third field is optional, so we will not select a field. Click Apply and Close to set the tags. The Out of Balance Journal Entries test is ready to go, but the Journal Entries with Specific Comments test cannot be run yet. The input column says Required, meaning our input is needed before the test can be run. Click Required. In order to run the Journal Entries with Specific Comments test, we need to provide the words we are looking for. We will enter birthday gift, refund, and donations. We can specify whether we want the test to also find empty comments and whether the keyword search should be case sensitive. Click OK to accept the parameters with the default settings. Both tests are ready to run. You can check one or both checkboxes, or on the Home tab, click Select All with Ready Status. Then click the Run button. IDEA is running the tests. When the tests finish running, close the Select and Run Audit Test dialog to return to the App Workflow screen. Now we will analyze the audit test results. Click on the Out of Balance Journal Entry Test. We can see all Out of Balance Journal Entries and click on the number of records to view the individual entries for that journal entry number. These preview windows can be saved to a database for further examination or we can click Done. To return to the test results, click Results and Reporting. Now click on Journal Entries with Specific Comments. 
we can see all the journal entries containing the words we specified in the test parameters. Click Results and Reporting again. Let's create a report of the test results. Check the boxes for the two tests and on the Home tab, in the Reporting group, click Create. Enter the details for the report and click OK. A report is generated with the results of the audit tests. This report can be saved or printed and shared with non-IDEA users. Save the report and then close it. Close the results and reporting window. We have completed the steps for the Sample General Ledger Smart Analyzer module. Close the App Workflow screen to return to IDEA.